Hi guys, welcome to Karen's Corner. Uh, this is quite a mess. I've been uh, going through all these items that I took from our trip to Gulpen. <laughs> Gulpen, yeah, here it is. Gulpen in the south of the Netherlands. And we also went to Germany for a day. And uh, I showed you that a few videos ago. And now I want to make a little book. So I've got all these items that I took with me, like this is uh, from McDonald's and I don't know, games we played and um, well, just some items. And I also printed out loads of photos. So I have this um, printer called a selfie and uh, I'm just learning <laughs> Uh, about sizes because I printed this one out and I think it's way too big and then I printed it out smaller So I'm getting there. This one is getting better So uh, sometimes pictures are a bit too big, but oh well. So guys, um, this is how my selfie works. This is the selfie <laughs> And so I've got this program this uh, collage program and I'm just gonna search for the pictures that I want So I think I want this one and this one and this one <laughs> and then you hit next oh well that's a nice image <laughs> wait a minute um, I have to do this ratio and then a layout I want two squares this one okay um, right now I want to swap this one with this one um, swap this one okay and I want to make this smaller because this is a real weird picture <laughs> oh wait first I need to do this the size has to be a little bit smaller otherwise I'll cut off her head <laughs> okay um, well this one is pretty nice but it can be a bit smaller And that's, this one is nice as well. I'm not really good at this, guys. <laughs> Wait. Well, I think this is okay. So, uh, I hit save. And then wait. Then we just print. And look what the selfie is gonna do. It's busy. Here we go. So step one is yellow. Sorry for the sound, that's awful. So, well, that's not much. It goes back in. And now we're gonna get magenta. Here it comes. <laughs> that's squeak. <laughs> So it's still not really a picture, but it goes back in. I'm just gonna add blue. And suddenly it's a picture. I really love this. And it goes back in for a protective layer. Look at that. So this is what I have. Ooh, machinery. Nice. Yes, I like it. So I've got lots of pictures <laughs> and I need to do a few more and then I'm going to make a little book. So this was our little trip and I'm going to cut these to size. And then I found a uh, lot of cards that I want to use. I wanted to make a small square book, but then I found out that I bought two of these. So, um, yeah, that isn't gonna fit in a square book. And uh, now I just see that I have this six same sect, same sect, exact same picture. Well, almost. <laughs> okay. Uh, anyways, uh, so I have to find something that's just as big as this. So I found these ones. So I'm gonna make a little book with two or three rings, and then I'm just gonna add some of these. And I don't know. So um, first. I'm going to cut these to size and then I'll get back to you and I don't know if this is going to be a one 
part video or two part video or if I'm gonna speed up or whatever. I've never done a voiceover. I really don't know how that works. Uh, maybe it's time that I start learning that. Uh, but uh, so I don't think this video is gonna be voiceover. But um, yeah, let's just get started. Okay guys, it's quite a mess on my desk, but uh, actually it's very organized because I just put all the things uh, of the hotel together and the breakfast. This is uh, the last day and this is when we went to uh, Aachen. Aachen? What's it in English again? Well, I'll just say Aachen, which is German. <laughs> and here I have my... Oh wait, this has to go over here as well. My cards and stuff. And I made a little template for my rings. I am going to use rings for this. So I started a little bit. Um, I had no idea how to start so I just... Wait, let's just get this out of the way. <laughs> wait just a second. So this is the last day. And this is Aachen, ja. <laughs> so uh, I thought uh, I wanted to start with a picture of the hotel but I didn't take a picture. So I took this little pamphlet, it says Gulpen, which is the name of the little place we were staying. And uh, I do have this one, but I only have one, so I want, should, wish I had taken two, so I could, this is the hotel, but uh, oh well. So uh, on the front I'm gonna put the Gulpen thing, and uh, which is such a funny name. Because, okay, the funny thing is for me to, uh, the word Gulpen doesn't mean anything to you, it just sounds like <laughs> But uh, for me it's funny too, because a gulp is a, a zipper in your jeans. So gulpen is the plural, so it's uh, multiple zippers. <laughs> it just sounds so weird. But the place where uh, this is in the south of the Netherlands, it probably means something else. But um, yeah, for me it means a zipper. <laughs> okay, so that's gonna go on the front and I don't know what else to put on there yet, so... So I just picked out some of the cards that I have and I thought, uh, well, this would be nice with this because uh, the room was very small. So smile when you get in. Uh, it was a bit of a disappointment. This was our dinner and, well, I just, you know, started building it up a little bit. So I'm just going to start with the front cover. <laughs> oh boy. So here we go. So I'm going to cut out the gulpen part. And where over there they don't say a harsh ch, they say a j. So they don't say gulpen, but they say gulpen, I think. <laughs> gulpen. Uh, probably uh, in their dialect it'll sound completely different. But, <laughs> oh well. Okay, so this was for miniature golf, but I saw this and I thought I can use that. And I was right. And I'm glad I did, because it's the only thing I have. <laughs> so, first I'm going to do this. So I made this little template and... This is where the holes are gonna be. So, um... I'm not sure if this is sturdy enough, it's not that, that thick of paper, so I found this. And maybe I'll just put, maybe for the front cover, I, it would be best to put some of these over here. So these are, I'm not sure if you can see it, but little plastic rings that you can put over it for a bit more support. <laughs> right. Okay. So, Gulpen is going to go over here. And guys, like I said, I'm not sure what to do yet, so I'm not going to glue it down yet. This uh, is open for ideas. But over here I want to put this, but I want it to be able to flip over. So I'm going to use some washi tape. And uh, I can write something over here and I can write something over here of course, but I have no idea what yet. So <laughs> I'm gonna leave that open too. Wow, this is a real nice informative video. Um, I'm gonna take this one. It's a travel one. It says first class bon voyage. Usually I think these things through better. Um, oh wait, these are the neighbors. This is this is the hotel. 
It looks very, really big, but it's just this part. <laughs> I thought, oh, come on. Okay, here we go. I can do this. Yes. And... Bon voyage. Okay, I have a very small spot to work with, or I can just take a bigger one and go all the way, well, I want to say all the way around, because now I have to cut this, if I want to flip it over, and you just left with a very small, small piece of <laughs> washi tape, oh well, uh, wait, I'm gonna put some other tape on the inside. Some bigger, this one. Okay. Ta da! Okay. So, uh, right. So I'm just going to start with the base basics, actually, the, well, the base. I'm just going to start putting some of these in and then I'll just come back, write stuff in it and add embellishments. So um, this is the first one. Okay, so this is the next little card. And I have this picture of our hotel room and it was very, very small. It was so small. If you've seen the video, you... Uh, you will know how small it was. <laughs> if you haven't, check out my video about this little trip. And um, I'm just gonna put this over here, I think. Yeah, so I'm just gonna make two holes in here. Oh, wait. Yeah, that's okay. So... These holes will get bigger and bigger. <laughs> okay, so this is gonna go over here. And over here I want to write something, but there are dots over there. So I thought it might be nice to put some paint on some places. Now this is opaque and I'm not sure if it will work. Maybe I'll have to do two or three layers, but oh well, let's just see. I thought I had a little piece of paper over here that I could use. I probably did, but it's gone. Okay, um, <laughs> a crafting space and no piece of paper. Here's a piece of... <laughs> oh, okay. And I did have this one. Let's just put this aside. <laughs> Paint chip. <laughs> okay, let's see if this works. So I'm just gonna go over it like this. nice it gives it a bit of an artsy look and well it gives me some space to write some some things down like what an awesome big room we had guys there was just one chair and we there were two of us and there was just um, I'm gonna try this by the way and add another layer well you know what no patience to let it dry. I'm just going to add another layer. <laughs> uh, so there was no table. There was just one chair. And it was so small. But it was just to sleep over there. And, um, well, we wanted to play a game called with a doublin with dice. I'll explain later. And um, there was just no room to sit. But we managed. So this one is going to go over here. I'm gonna leave this to dry and um, oh I have to clean my brush of course so the next ones I'm gonna do uh, when they're finished I'm gonna do them all at once because it's weird to do that uh, one by one you have to clean it every time so this needs to dry okay next we have uh, okay the hotel room was very very small that was really a disappointment but the food guys it was 
amazing. It was so delicious. <laughs> um, so, oh well, that made up for the small hotel room. So I made a picture of the soup and our chicken thing. And I did have one of our dessert. But it was so delicious I forgot to take a picture. So I took a picture when it was finished. So I'm just going to add these. I can write some over here. And then I want to put this one here. I can write something over there. And this is when we had some tea in our room. And I just can just write it over there. Maybe just put some paint over there. So here I go. I'm gonna glue these on the cart. Okay, here I go. So this one. And maybe I want some of this. Just over here, just like that. <gasps> and then put this over here. Oh. <laughs> oh, nice. This is a round, rounded corner. <laughs> okay, that's nice. So again, guys, I'm just going for the bases. Is that how you say that? Um, oh, I forgot the holes. Ha ha ha. Oh well, that's okay. Uh, they're gonna go through the picture now. <laughs> um. That one is in between. Uh, I'm going for the beginning and I'm just going to embellish it later on. But every now and then I can put something in here. So uh, <clears throat> let's put some holes in here. Like now I forgot to put in the holes. But it will give a little bit of a fun effect. So the picture is... Um, ooh, confetti. <laughs> there are holes in the picture. Oh well, that's okay. So this one is going to go like that confetti oh maybe I can put them I'm gonna save the confetti for a while <laughs> I don't know what to do with it yet but oh well um, okay so this is mm. you can hardly see it can you oh well, like this and this is us having some tea I can put something in here right it down that is a nice idea but that's for later these are just the bases next we have this we played a game this one was already there and we just played four games <laughs> and this one is from my husband it says lost win lost and lost again <laughs> so I won <laughs> anyways uh, we played uh, two games each night so um, I thought I'd save these and put them in this little thing I can cut a bit off of this one um, so I'm going to fold it double. Will it fit? No, it won't. Why not? That's just mean. <laughs> it's just, just... Okay, I'm just going to cut a bit off. I'll make it fit. So guys, I can't explain uh, how you play the game. <laughs> It'll be a long video. But it's called Dobbelen in Dutch and it's really fun to do. You play it with five dice each and um, it's really fun. So I'm going to put this in here. This is a passport thing. And I'm just going to put it in here. But first I need to make some holes <laughs> before I uh, forget. Um, otherwise I just put this in and put holes in that as well. I know myself. So <laughs> I think it's really, really good that I remembered. Oh boy, this is not good for my hands. Oh well, one more. Oh boy, I can't do this. But there's no one home to help me. Okay, I can't do this. Maybe I can try it again. Ah, okay. Ah, should not have done that. <laughs> oh well. Ah, okay, here we go. So I can put this one over here. And um, I need to put something on here, but I don't know what yet. So I'm just going to leave that 
for later. As I do with everything. <laughs> this is a really interesting video, isn't it? So then we have breakfast, guys. So this time I'm going to do the holes first. I can still do it. Well, this is easier. Okay. Uh, breakfast. So I showed you in the video that we had Hegelslag, Hagelslag. And that's just one in here. <laughs> Let's get it out. So, of course, Hagelslag. I didn't take a picture because breakfast wasn't that, well, that special actually. We didn't even have croissants. I love my croissant if I go on a holiday, but no, no croissants. So I'm just going to put uh, two Hagelslag thingies on here. Maybe that's a bit boring. I can write over here breakfast and I can put one of these over here. So. And one over here. Why not? <laughs> so um, normally I make this when I'm on holiday, but when I get home it's I think it's more difficult to make a book like this because you don't really know what to do yet. Mm, I'm not saying that very clearly, but um, when you're there, you, you know what happened exactly at that moment and you, it's just easier to make this. Hagelslag. So normally I just take one for breakfast, but oh well, I didn't have my croissants, so I just put both of them on my bread. <laughs> And I loved it. Okay, so what's next? Next we have this stuff. What's this? Oh, this is the tea we had for breakfast. Oh, okay, you know what? This was my idea to put this in here and write on here uh, what we thought of breakfast. And of course I need to do this with my cutting tool, but I don't have the patience for that. Luckily there are little dots on here. <laughs> There's a little line I can cut. Ah. Okay, so I'm just gonna glue this on, not with washi tape, but with some of this. English breakfast tea. And of course, guys, uh, my husband and I share one tea bag and then I took the other home with me and we did that the other day, the second day as well. So I've got two of these, one for my friend and one for me. <laughs> yes, I also saved one of those because I want them in my collection. <laughs> Maybe I already have them, but oh well. Okay, so this one is gonna go neatly over here. And then I can write something on here. So that's breakfast. Okay, well, that was breakfast and then we went to Aachen. Uh, so, I can put holes in here as well. <laughs> That's why I wanted to make this book bigger. As I just said, I wanted to make it a little square book, but then I thought, no, I have some postcards and those are bigger. But now I have more room to write on, so. So this one is gonna go like this. And here I can write, we went to Aachen. Aachen. So here I have, uh, not sure if you can see it, but um, road signs showing the way to Aachen. So I'm just going to put that over here. But first I want to put some of this uh, over here. Oh well, over here. Make it a bit more interesting. Okay. Um, Let's see if I don't have it upside down, no, like that. So here is the road signs and over here I can write something. So when we were over there, we went to a store where they sold party goods. <laughs> if you saw my video, my husband tried on some of these party hats. Oh, and I want to write about it over here and over here, but look, this is too busy so I need to put some of, uh, of that some paint on this one but first let's just see I'm just gonna put it in like this the holes 
So uh, these two are going to go over here and I'm going to paint this one. So that's all I have right now. But uh, this one is dry. So I can put it in. Is it dry? No, not, not really. Uh, where are my rings? So this is what I have so far. I'm not really good at this. <laughs> How do I do this? Ah. Another ring and I have another ring somewhere over here. Guys, I hope you don't you don't find this video too boring. <laughs> I'm just trying to make this and uh yeah. I hope it's not too boring. Uh well, I don't know what to say at a moment like this except for this is difficult <laughs> okay so uh, usually when I make something like this I do it day by day and then you just put one day in here and that's just one little ring um, it's, it's uh, one thing to put in here so it's not that difficult but look look it looks like a book right now still not sure what to do with this so yes I am I'm just gonna take this, put it over here, and I'm gonna take the other one. Again, guys, with things like this, don't overthink it too much, just do it. Well, but you have to make sure it's a bit straight. Okay. <laughs> oh, would have been easier if it wasn't in the binder yet. Ha <laughs> ha. In the little book. <laughs> okay, well. Okay. So now I can also glue this one on with double sided tape, of course. Okay. So this is the front. I'm gonna put something over there about where we went and when we went there. I've got this one. This was the dinner. I'm gonna put something in here. This one sticks out a bit too much, so I'm just gonna put it in if I can. And no, I can't. <laughs> okay, you know what? I'm just gonna cut this off. That's better. Okay. So this, oh, I can write over here that we played that game, so I can put some paint on here as well. Uh, breakfast and breakfast and then we went to Aachen. So see how nice that looks. When I was working at this, uh, like I said, I just don't really know what to do when I start with this, but you just have to start with uh, what you want to put in here and then it starts to look really nice, put some washi tape on there and then you start to write and add some embellishments and stuff and then it'll become a real book. So I think um, I'm going to finish this book the way I did now, you get the gist of what I'm doing. And then in my next video, because this is going to be a two-part video, I'm going to show you, um, uh, do a flip through and put some uh, embellishments on here. Show you how to embellish it and maybe write something in it. And uh, yeah, because I don't have the time to finish this right now. So I'm going to finish it uh, maybe tonight or tomorrow. And then when the book is finished, I'm going to put on my camera again and embellish it together with you. So I hope you liked this video. I hope it wasn't too boring because um, here I'm going to say it again. I keep repeating myself, but I always think it's hard to start something like this. And I wanted to show you how I do it, how I start uh, a little book like this when I have all these items and I really don't know what to do. I just sort them by day and just start, start somewhere and then the fun fun is gonna happen when you have a little book like this and you can start embellishing so if you like the video i would love a thumbs up and if you want to see more of my videos then just hit that subscribe button of course and i hope you are excited to see the next part of this video it might be more exciting than this one uh but anyways all that's left to say is groetjes from holland bye from <laughs> bye